what you can see here is the remains of an old corn mill. I'm not sure how old it is, but it's ruined now. It was once powered by a massive water wheel, which was round this side. So I think this will just be a short video and I'll take some photographs because this side is completely uh, collapsed. I'd just like to say that this is a permission visit. We've just seen some planning signs nearby, so we're not sure whether it's going to shortly be demolished. Wow. Oh my God, look at that. That is very cool. As you can see, it's structurally unsafe, so I'm clearly not going to go in because that would be a bit foolish. There's lots of wild garlic growing here and there's some barbed wire. I'm going to take my chance and go under it. You can see the whole of the roof has come off. I'm quite glad actually we've got permission because I was thinking of just stopping. But my mum actually has a vague connection with the owners. Right, I'm going to try and duck under this barbed wire. Oh, very cool. I don't know if you can see there. Let's try and zoom in. There's actually a pram right on the edge. You can see that the structure is actually made out of like tree trunks. I'm not sure what that is. A piece of furniture some description. It's kind of carved, a dresser, a pan round. You can see there's some chairs. I'm not sure, something with a mirror on it behind them. I'm sorry if my hands are a bit shaky. There's a table. I thought that this was the side where the wheel was, but I must be wrong. I've seen a picture online, but it's got a copyright on it. And uh, it's a local history society's got it. Sorry, we're near a road. And there was a massive water wheel on one side. It must be the other side because there's a stream just down by there. I'm going to see if I can see any remnants of the wheel. I wonder how safe this is to climb up. I didn't bring a torch. Oh, cool. Some kind of machinery in there. As I said, again, I apologise for the shakes. My hands are a bit shaky for some reason. There's a workbench with a vice. I could possibly slide down there, but I really don't think it's structurally safe. My mum just spoke to the lady who owns it and she said, just do what you like. So, uh, there's some kind of lever. I wonder if that, actually that looks like where the water wheel would have been attached. I've got my other camera in the car, so I'll take some stills. Oh, I've just seen something cool. If I can get round. Look, there's an old hoover. You see the handle there? And a better look at that piece of furniture. You can see all this twisted metal. The whole of this side has just dropped out. Wow, I can just see something else weird. See that blue bit? That's the front of a car with a headlight hole, I think. And a better view of the pram. That's kind of mad. 
I'm just going to see if I can look around the end where the wheel might have been. I think I'm going to get my mum to come out of the car, so I might have a closer look. So if it just falls on me, there's someone here. Random car steering wheel. Oh, whoops, I've just fallen out some. Looks like there's some workings in there or something. And another one of those tree trunk supports. And here would be the, I don't know if I can get down without falling. Oh, ah, oh, that's where the wheel would have been. You can see, I can't get into the field, but you can see that's where the huge water wheel would have been on the side that I've seen in a picture. The water's no longer running down the uh, mill race, but it would have run all the way there. It's all silted up. And it would have come all the way along there. You can just see there's some pools of water laying in the woods. <coughs> Excuse me. And there's a bunch of sheep in the field. I don't think I can get around the other side. There's a bit of a window frame. The more I look, the more I see. That looks, oh, big time rotten, look at that. I'm gonna climb back up and go round and get my stills camera and see if my mum will come with me just in case the roof falls if I try and go in.